illegal dumping, it's a problem one councilman says his di district is up against. Some point fingers at several changes to the city of Toledo's garbage pickup, but today there was a chance to throw anything away for free. Barrett Andrews is on the scene with how excited people were to hear that word. <laughs> Well, I can tell you this, Thursday at the news conference for this event, we were told there'd be two big dumpsters out here for this event, this free dump day as it's called. Today they actually had to add a third, at least, to keep up with everything. When they transferred us to the smaller bins, the garbage bins for the city, I didn't know what to do with my stuff. A lot of things in my basement attic that I wanted to get rid of, and this was a great opportunity. I feel so much freer in my house. Before today, Carla Legree had been feeling the pressure. First, it was the switch to automation. Now it's the word that big item pickups will be limited to one per family every three months. Anything else is 50 bucks. The city of Toledo, by their own admission, didn't change the policy for bulk pickup when they should have adjusted it right along with the rollout of automation. That's when Councilman Michael Ashford pitched the idea of these free dump days, this being the first in the program. He says he's getting more and more complaints about illegal dumping in his district and hopes this will curb that problem, along with providing a little help to those with a little more trash than they expected. The city does care, so I guess we just need to be patient as people that are taxpayers and rely on them as best we can to get the job done. So in this case, we appreciate the city. Now another option if you're figuring out that your trash really doesn't fit in the one bin you've got provided by the city, you can actually buy another bin. It's a one-time fee that just depends on the size. We're on the scene at Central Toledo. Barrett Andrews, Fox Toledo News.